the school has been forming men for greatness for a hundred years. And today, you can find students from the Diocese of Brooklyn, from the Archdiocese of New York, and from the Diocese of Rockville Center here at Cathedral Preparatory School and Seminary. These students are receiving a very special visit from the leader of the Archdiocese of New York, Cardinal Timothy Dolan. Him coming to visit, him showing us what our studies can do, what our studies can bring us towards, is uh, it's very meaningful. Him coming to visit shows he's proud of Cathedral and he's recognized our mission, our goal here. The goal is also the motto, forming men for greatness. The high school wants to create a nourishing environment where young men can clearly hear God's calling, whether it be to marriage, to single or consecrated life, or to the priesthood. It is the only high school in the country that offers priestly-minded teens a preparation for the seminary. And by doing so, it makes sure that this important vocation is not forgotten in the whirl of life discernment. What everybody else is talking about, what college you want to go to, or what the job do you want to have, what profession. Why shouldn't the church be in there vigorously saying, hey, don't forget when you're asking these good questions, don't forget to think about the priesthood. Rector President Father Joseph Fonti is one of three priests on staff. He says this, along with daily mass, offers these young men the opportunity to see priests in action, which is important no matter what their vocation. And we have mass every day and other moments of, of interaction with them that helps them to see the life of the priest as attractive, as, as meaningful, as purposeful. To prepare men for the priesthood, the three dioceses, Brooklyn, Rockville Center, and the New York Archdiocese, are collaborating. Students who graduate from Cathedral Prep might go on to minor seminary at the Immaculate Conception Center in Douglaston, and then on to the major seminary at St. Joseph's in Dunwoody. The collaboration makes the program even stronger. If, please God, <clears throat> some of these men do persevere and become priests, they're going to be working together. We got these three dioceses. They might be separate dioceses, but we all work together. When our future priests know each other, it's going to uh, improve the effectiveness of their priestly ministry. In a show of solidarity, the students proudly present Cardinal Dolan a school shirt to the sound of grateful applause. The Cardinal says he looks forward to working even more closely with the leader of the Brooklyn Diocese, Bishop Nicholas DiMarzio, and the leader of Rockville Center, Bishop William Murphy, to send even more young men to Cathedral Prep in the future. It hasn't let me down. I enjoy what I see. I think this is the only school where you can feel like welcomed and everybody's looking out for you. I'm going deeper into my faith, going deeper into uh, what it means to be a Christian, what it means to be Catholic. And that is something I don't believe that I could experience as deeply anywhere else as I could at Cathedral. I mean, four years of theology here, I mean, you can't get it anywhere at any other school. It's uh, three priests on staff, you can't get it anywhere else. This is the best place. With the century-long history behind Cathedral Prep and the three dioceses collaborating even more closely together for the future, the hope is that they'll still be creating Men for Greatness another century from now. For Curtis from Elmhurst, I'm Katie Breidenbaugh.